Christian Nickridge here and today we're going to do a favorites video. Okay, so we're going to do a October favorites. Um, now, I haven't done favorites in a long time. I don't remember the last one, but it was a long time ago, I think. And I just, I don't, I don't know. I, I haven't been having favorites lately. It's just like me doing my makeup like just regular basis and like whatever. Like, there's not been a thing that's been my favorite like oh my god I would die for like the the ride or die tag I really wanted to do that but there's nothing that I would like like ride or die with like not really that kind of stuff but I do love all the stuff that I have but they're not really ride or die stuff like I love them to death but they're not ride or die. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I love them, but they're not ride or die. So, let's just get on with this video. This first. Um, this is a mirror, and yeah, it's not really like the blushes. This is the e.l.f. blush palette, and it doesn't, oh, this is, and this is light. This is the, the blush palette that's light, uh, and the mirror is just a bomb. You're going to see my door right now. Uh, and I love the mirror. I use it for everything. I need to clean it. But the colors are also good as well. Um, they're not ride or die products. But they're really good. They, like, they blend really good. They're really pretty colors. I really, really like them. So, but... the My favorite thing about this is the mirror. I just love how it, like... I don't know, I just love the mirror. Okay, so now we're gonna go on with highlighters. These two have been my favorite. It's like literally awesome. <sighs> These two highlight, I have it on my shoulder. I don't know if you could see it. I have it wherever you highlight. That's that's where I have it. Um yeah, so these two are my favorite highlighters. And they're the Wet n Wild highlighters. This is the highlighter I'll have a Cosmo. And this is the highlighter Boozy Brunch. They're really good. But this is these two are really good together. I feel like mostly this one. It doesn't. This one's like a pink highlighter, as you guys can see. Um, I'll show you get guys right now. This one's like a pink highlighter, and it's really, really gorgeous. Uh, I use this highlighter like every day when I do my makeup and this highlighter highlighter uh, looks like this and it's just a gold it just looks like I every time I look at it I just remind myself of cheetah girls like I don't know it just has that kind of color of cheetah girls it has pink it has brown it has gold cheetah girls that's what I call it sometimes cheetah girls Every, to me, like, every subtle, like, more calming, like, not too much highlighter can bring other highlighters out more. And that's what this is, more, like, natural highlight. But I feel like natural highlight can bring out hi other highlighters out way more. Bring their true colors out. So now I'm going to go with lip glosses. This is a Revlon lip gloss. I don't know what I... It's just, it's just it's a Revlon lip gloss. It looks like this. And I really love the packaging. It's to die for, to be honest. And I think this is in the color Sky Pink, I believe. I think... Yeah, Sky Pink. It's what I have on now. I just replied it because I need more. I, 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 I've been obsessed with lip glosses lately. I just need more in my life. Like, I can't. Like, I literally am obsessed with lip glosses lately. I don't know why, but lip glosses have just been my thing. But the only thing that sucks about it is that I can't find a 24-hour lip gloss. I don't even know if there is one in the world. But, like, seriously, like, I want a 24 hour of lip gloss because I hate reapplying and reapplying and reapplying every single day. So, that's the one thing I hate about lip glosses. And the next one is uh, Ulta Butter Balm Lip Gloss. I can't with this stuff. This is just so beautiful. I just love it so much. It's like... So, it makes your lips, like, literally the shiniest thing I, like, you ever seen in your entire life. Like, it makes your lips so, so shiny with, a, with like, an undercolor on, like, a lipstick or a lip matte 
or just your lips. It just makes it so shiny. <sighs> then the next one is Ulta Shiny Sheer Lip Gloss. Oh, this one was called Bell. This one, this one's called Bell, by the way, and this one's called Pink. This one I haven't been using. I used it once, and I really, really like it, and I plan on using it more. But my hands just go for these two. Like they just like say, you're going with this one, or you're going with this one. And I really want to get into this one a lot more. So I plan on using this really soon because this is good too. And then the last thing is this Ulta Makeup Setting Spray. I am so sorry, guys, that I have not took, like posted a picture of this and like say, oh, this is good or, or this is bad or this is just really good. But you, I wouldn't get it because there's this, like other good ones out there. Um, but this one is really good. Every single time that I want to tell you guys how I feel about this, like, I want to look what my makeup looks like at the end of the day, but I keep forgetting that. Like, I just take off my makeup and I was like, wait, I was supposed to see... I was supposed to see if my makeup looked good or not. And I just forget. Like, I, my, my brain just says, like, when I put on my makeup, my brain says, okay, now put on the setting spray and at the end of the day, you look at your makeup and see if it looks good. And then I take off my makeup at, at night and then like I forget to like look at myself in the mirror and like say oh it looks good I look really good but if you're like a beginner of makeup I would get this and it, it works perfectly fine it's really good but if you're like really like you've been doing makeup for a long time and you ran out of your NYX dewy finish uh, setting spray I would not go and get this, I would just go get the NYX Dewy Finish or the Matte Finish or something like that because I feel like this, this is way more better ones out there, but this is really good as well, so. Okay, baby bitches, I hope you guys like this video, and also, you like my background, I really like it. My blanket is the other way around, if that makes sense, I don't know, but I did put up my thing here, my thing. It says, I don't believe in basic, and I have that always been there, and then I have that which says, enjoy the little things, and always enjoy, enjoy the little things because that's important. So I'm going to go in the car because today I'm going to a baby gender reveal, and I cannot wait to go. This is my first gender reveal party, um, Brooklyn. She's been on this channel before once, and comment down below if you want to see her more. She, her mom is pregnant, and I want her to have a boy so bad because she has one boy, and she has three girls, and I just want her to have another boy. I'm, <laughs> I'm like, like, please God, please let it be a boy, please. Because, like, the girls are just outnumbering, like, the boys, like, it's, 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 I'm really excited to go. I'm like really, really nervous. Like, so if you guys are watching this, um, Miss Jen, which is the girl that's pregnant, and Brooklyn, and all you other guys, congratulations. Whatever you guys have, I have no idea what you guys are having, and I'm finding out soon. And while I'm editing this video, I put the gender right here, so you guys know what the gender is, and you guys can celebrate with me. I really hope it's a boy. I don't know until I edit this, to be honest. But that's it for you guys. I hope you guys like this video. I hope you guys like me, as always. And hit that red button. Hit that subscribe button. And hit that like button if you haven't already. Comment what you want to see next if you're a, a baby butcher already. Um, but, yeah, I don't think there's anything else to tell you guys. So, share fan friends and strangers. And I'll see you guys next time. I love you guys. Three girls and one boy and one on the way. Like, what the heck? Congratulations, guys. I love you guys. I love you guys so much. Brooklyn, I love your family. Your family's awesome. Yancey, Katie, Shasta.